My name is Robert. I'm a uh, patient of Dr. Mark Wickman. Um, five and a half weeks ago, I had ACL reconstructive surgery on my right knee. It's from a hockey injury. Um, they did a different technique uh, than when I had surgery in 2005, which was on my left knee from a football injury. This time, the doctor made uh, two tunnels through my tibia and my femur, and so my ACL is anchored in much the same way that the natural ACL is. Um, this time, I'm way ahead of schedule where I was last time. I'm looking forward to a full recovery within the next couple of months. Hi, I'm uh, John, a physical therapist at the Aurora Sports Medicine and Rehab here at Mayfair. So I'm working with Robert here, who uh, just completed this, um, well, surgery for his ACL. Uh, so today's session, I've, I've seen Robert for about four weeks now. I actually saw him um, a week or a couple of weeks before surgery, because after the injury, that when he sustained that injury, his range of motion wasn't quite there. So the doctor ordered um, therapy so that we can get more motion back so it's easier for the rehab. So today's session, um, I usually start him on the bicycle and then, um, you know, to warm the knee or treadmill or whatever we need to do. Um, today's session, we'll start with some range of motion exercises, right? Okay? The, right there, yeah. Yeah, yeah so uh, during my previous surgery, um, my hamstring, or after surgery rather, my hamstring was in a lot of pain mm -hmm. for a good two, three weeks after this. Yeah. Um, this time, I believe they harvested it a bit differently. Uh, it's, they took a much smaller piece than they did last mm -hmm. time. And so my hamstring was only in pain for no more than a week afterwards, which was great. You know, the, the, the lesser the tape from the hamstring, and the better it is. Yeah. Because, you know, less scarring, um, you know, less traumatic to the joint or yeah. to the muscle itself. Certainly. Mm -hmm. And I, I, I mean, I know for a fact that last time I was, uh, with my previous surgery, mm -hmm. I wasn't doing any hamstring exercises for, I think it's about two months afterwards. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's so much faster, like, the accelerate that we have, this, you know, progression of the exercises is so much more intense or aggressive yeah. than the one before. Mm -hmm. How does that feel? Great. Okay. It's great, though, because, you know, I, I was able to start rehab, you know, really quickly upon, you know, having my surgery completed, yeah. which was great because my muscles didn't really atrophy very much. And that's the thing, too, the longer you wait for rehab to start, then the more chances of, you know, scar tissue grabbing onto things where mm -hmm. they're not supposed to, and muscles get weaker, like, like really fast. Going down, yeah. Okay. Right about yeah. there is perfect. Good. Yeah, it feels good. Yeah. See you at the pet in a couple of weeks.